I'm Paul Levinson, and welcome to Light On, Light Through, episode 169, a review of Stissel 3, which I think of as Cheesecake and Faith. Well, it's been a little while since I've had a new episode of Light On, Light Through, so what better occasion than to review the third season of this delightful, profound Israeli show, Shtisel. The wife and I binge-watched the third season of Shtisel on Netflix. Hey, it debuted on my birthday, March 25th, so how could I resist? And, in addition to that, I was delighted to find that these nine new long-awaited episodes also had a shout-out for me. That's right. There was a fairly major family named Levinson in the third season of Stussel, so thank you. Much appreciated. And... These episodes were immensely enjoyable, especially the ending, I have to say, which had more happy endings than I've ever seen in a series before. Kiva defies his father and goes to live with his wife, Racheli. Yosela defies his mother and says he will marry Shira Levy, Not Shira Levinson, but that's okay. I'm still very happy for Yosela. Shulam, the main character, the center of this series, may be able to reconcile with his brother. And, most important, Rahama and her baby are both fine. Their faith beat the thousand-to-one odds. And you know, with so many unhappy endings in our real world, Trump's defeat being a remarkable exception, a blessing, it was gratifying and timely indeed to see so much happiness at the end of Shtissel. Now, the language, the Yiddish, was also a joy to hear, as it always is. Where else can you hear the word for kachta, as Nochem Shulam's brother says his finances are? Oh, that's a familiar situation for many people. And to stay with the same character, the same sentiment, and the same area of the body as metaphor, it was also good to hear Nochem tell his brother that he, Shulam, is a shtick direct. And that was also well-deserved in that case. And the food, well, that was geschmacked to the max. The cheesecake from Britzel made my mouth water. By the way, is Britzel a real place? Hey, send me some of that cheesecake. Look at this great publicity I'm giving you. No charge. The lesson Stissel so effectively conveyed, from the power of food to the power of art to the power of faith, are not only very appealing, they're deeply memorable. And the acting was outstanding, too. Dovla Glickman as Shulam, Michael Aloni as Kiva, Shira Hassaj Rukama and Sasan Gabe as Nukim, the brother, were all just perfect. And I also especially liked Daniela Curtis as Raquel and Reef Neiman as Shira Levy. The ending did tie up a lot of stories, but hey, there's always room for another season. And you know what? I drop everything else to see it, even if it doesn't debut on my birthday. The Light on Light Through podcast. Well, I hope you enjoyed this little review of Stissel, which is a great, big, wonderful series. I'll be back here soon with another episode of Light on Light Through. Could be another review. Could be some political commentary. In the meantime, stay safe and enjoy.
Athens, 2042 AD. She ripped the paper in half, then ripped the halves, then ripped what was left again into bits and pieces of history that could have been. Sierra Waters had read once that, years ago, it was thought that men made love for the thrill, while women made love for the sense of connection it gave them. Curled up with a good book says, Sierra Waters is sexy as hell. You can find out more about The Plot to Save Socrates by Paul Levinson at theplottosavesocrates.com. about an ancient biotech war raging on in secret for centuries.